is this Tokyoverse shorts? Kiss, Rock and Roll Over. This album is their first studio album that accurately captured how they sound. Personally, it's one of my favorite Kiss albums, right behind Kiss Alive 2 and Destroyer. After 1976's Destroyer, Kiss had a choice, A, continue down that road and see what they could do with the epic, orchestrated sound that Bob Ezrin got out of them, or B, return to their rock roots. I'm glad they went with Plan B. Personally, it's one of my favorite Kiss albums, right behind Kiss Alive 2 and Destroyer. This is a classic Kiss album. I Want You, Take Me, Calling Dr. Love, Ladies Room, Mr. Speed, Hard Luck Woman. This is a classic Kiss album. It's an album full of great hard rock songs, and one of the best performances of Ace Frehley. The guitar work is brilliant, not only on the first track, but throughout the whole album, being the most remarkable instrumental aspect of rock and roll over. I gotta tell ya, who would have thought, that after just one more studio album, which is 1977's Love Gun, who would have thought that the end of their golden era would be just around the corner? All the internal tensions, addiction battles, an oversaturated market and changing musical tides, would send the group into rapid decline, 